Hello Internet, I am Xenon and welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Rebirth. So, I'm going to go as a Zazzle this time, all he's got left is like a, a chest win. But, I want to win. <laughs> oh, we've been uh, pretty, pretty strapped for wins lately. And it's something that I've noticed is a, a disturbing trend. And it's basically that, in, in recordings, I, I don't win. And then, as soon as I'm not recording, bam, win. And I'm like ridiculously overpowered and no doubt. And it's easy. And I just got hit by a stupid thing. This room is actually very harsh for the first fighting room I've encountered in the run. But it's an XL floor, that would be why, and it's on the cellar too. Alright. Yeah, it seems that in the, the videos that I record, I just get really bad luck with items. And we're like just scraping by. And then, as soon as I don't record, I do a, like an Eden run and get Mum's Knife. Like, start with Mum's Knife. It's just ridiculous. Go easy on me game. Monstro's Tooth. Ah, uh, so this is someone's Monstro, he, he drops in on an enemy and then jumps away. Can't use it on Monstro. And that's Daddy Long Legs. Uh, foot's gonna temporarily, or occasionally, stomp on our enemies, that's what this shadow is. And watch, watch, watch. Ah, oh, you chose the wrong one. It's gonna get the big one. Don't need the shop. Alright, just stop the same thing I'm already killing. Makes sense. Well, and I'm glad we've got flying when that happens. Now, please blow up this one too. <laughs> well, it gave me a bomb anyway. Oh, we got small rock. Damage up. They used to come with a speed down as well in the original. Doesn't happen in this one. Which is good. Alright, continue onwards. Use the rocks for cover. Oh, good, Daddy Longlegs working to great effect there. What else was there? The full. Okay, full card's fairly useless. I might use that to get into a curse room. We just have to remember it's there. And I do indeed have a bomb. I didn't go to blow that up because I didn't think I had one, but I must have picked one up without noticing. This is a very small XL floor. And there's another tinted rock. Alright. A haunt. Well, I have a feeling we're going to be using uh, Monstro's Tooth against this boss, and not the other one. Go, Monstro! Nice shot. Alright, health up. Next boss. Let's pin. He's already half health. He's cake. Alright. Speed and range up. What have we got in here? We have Demon Baby and the Shovel. I'm not getting either of those for a heart. Health up. Okay, that's nice. It's nice to get a health up on the Devil. <laughs> devil Room. <laughs> Still not exchanging it for Demon Baby though. Give us a chance at Angel Room. Um, then I guess if we get... Oh, there is no Curse Room. There's no bombs. I do have enough money to make the shop worthwhile though. So let's go do that. And we got there's options for half price. We'll take it. We won't use two of diamonds yet. If I'd known that was in there before we went to the boss fight. Oh, because that's our first room shop. Uh, first floor shop. And, um... You know, it's half price. Could have done that before I fought two bosses. And of course, now we get the curse room when I don't have access to the teleport card anymore. Let's see if we can get to the uh, the boss rush room. Have I done that on camera yet? I'm not sure. I don't think I have. I haven't played a Zazzle in a recording in a while. And with a Zazzle, you tend to get uh, the boss rush. Now, I might actually take Guppy's head over Monstro's Tooth. Because Monstro's Tooth is decent on the first, you know, one or two bosses, like on pin. Um, but after that, he doesn't do much damage. And also, because it's a three room charge, tends to, um, you know, make me hesitate from using it. 
As Guppy's head, I use every room. Much easier to do it. Number one. We already have short range, so this is probably just going to be a tears up. Yep, and it's yellow. Alright, I'm fine with that. So number one normally just makes you, like, shoot out a pea stream of tears. Hang on, how did that happen? Must have did contact damage. So I was like, if I stand in the middle, their tears aren't going to shoot me. Um, doesn't work if they jump into you, though. The work that his tears didn't shoot me, but you know what I mean. Whatever, we got our boss room. So let's go. The husk. Oh, I hate bonflies. Damn it! <laughs> Full heart of damage. Um, so this one's a damage up, that's a health up. We'll take the damage. The wafer. That is absolutely awesome. We take half damage. Let's try and get us a spirit heart and fight the angel. No spirit heart. Do get an angel fight. Ha, <laughs> the fire hurts him, that's nice. Good touch, I agree. It's very hard to hit though. With this attack. Ah, oh, No. Yeah, that's what I was waiting for. Go daddy long legs. Win the fight for me. Alright, I'm not going to waste my last bomb to potentially get a, the spirit heart out of the fire. Let's go check the rest of the floor. We should be good on time. Yeah, six minutes. We're done with the third floor. I think that's a win. Alright, so if we get teleport, it'd be nice to go in there. And then I think we might even if we don't get teleport, to be honest. Well, that is a double health up. <coughs> ah, sorry. Had to uh, clear my throat there, a bit of an itch. I think we'll go in here. Double spirit heart, that's nice. Justification was, you know, it was going to be probably a red chest. And uh, I already got one guppy item, so. Not going to go to the shop this time, because at most we'll have six cents. If I use the two of diamonds, not going to be worth it. Alright. Our health is actually stacking up nicely, which is odd for an Azazel run. Or Azazel. I don't even know what to call him. Ah, oh, I thought you guys were the, the bone guys for a minute there. Alright, free money. It's making the shop more, look more likely on this floor. Here's the bone guys. Wheel of Fortune, yeah, whatever. Alright, big room. It's gonna be hard to dodge. Uh, Alright, so what I have to do with them is kind of dodge in after they shoot. Quite difficult. I think my range actually might be a little lower with uh, number one. The Joker, okay. Ah, oh, we've got a curse of not knowing what the hell things are. I'm going to take one. I'm going to take another one. Okay, I'm happy with that. <laughs> uh. Alright, we're doing better now. I doubt I'll get um, the rest of the key now because I, I took a deal with the devil. Nice attacks. Oh, kill a couple of rocks. So that's enough. We need Guppy's head back. Thank you. Alright, kill our boss. Yeah, we can do it. Yeah. 
Done. One murdered Gertie. Well, we'll go for question mark number 59. Alright. See if we can find our shop. There we go. That was very prophetic of me. That's well, greed, so it's not really a shop, it's a mini boss fight. And he actually got a hit in. Like, things happen so fast, I can't even tell if he's even fired and he, he hits me. <laughs> uh, it'd be nice if we get some more uh, spirit hearts. At this stage, I'm not going to go to that curse room unless we get more health. Okay, places for secret room is probably here. There we go. That was the most likely one. That's an item. Could be raw liver. It's raw liver. Alright. <laughs> Could have also been the unk or uh Oh what is what else? One up. Old's brain probably. I wouldn't wouldn't surprise me if they slipped that in there. Alright, that was very quick. The Emperor card. Alright, we use two diamonds now. We'll take the Emperor card with us. Alright, getting a bit of frame loss, but I think it was only temporary. It's a bad dodge on my part. Alright, wasn't too bad. That's the mulligan. Spawns flies when we shoot. That's pretty good. I'm becoming a fly machine now. There's only one hand. Pill, wizard, won't affect me. the Fly King. Almost sounds like a Pokemon. Fly King! That's about right, isn't it? Oh, I'm so glad that didn't hurt me. I don't think I'm ever taking number one as Azazel again. As the range is a little lower. It's not much. Drop plus one. We'll go ahead and do this. There was a Tinted Rock in that pile of rocks. Synthal we shall take. Damage plus range. Then we've got um, Pentagram, which we're going to take, and then Missing Page 2, which is absolute rubbish. It's Tinted Rock over here. Alright, and then Tinted Rock here. Alright, we get our bombs back too. I'm liking this. Okay, we'll scoot on down, see if we can find our shop. How we f Whoa, we're well and truly okay for time. Alright. Has to get Guppy's tail, actually. Shop. We got Humbling Bundle, which we shall take. And then we got Pandora's Box, which we shall take, use. We got Oodles of Spirit Hearts. I'm happy with that. Alright. Let's donate. Alright, wedge ourselves in. I'll go down to like 10 cents. Alright, that's enough. Okay, we got another room, a couple of rooms over this way. It's probably an arcade on this floor. Oh no, it's not an even number. Never mind, can't be. We will check the, the curse room now. Bombs away. Spirit heart out of it. That's ooh, three spirit hearts. All right, now we're talking full health. Bar a tiny bit, but you know, you know what it's like. Okay, where would I hide the secret room? It's not very often surrounded on all four sides. I'll check here. Damn it, it is here. All right. 
And I'm fine with keys. This makes me want uh, Guppy's tail even more. Now we'll GTFO. Head down through our last of what I like to call the normal floors. And do the mum fight. If we kill it before 20 minutes, then I have to finally show off the bus, ru bus boss rush fight. Which I've done on like two or three characters. Already have done it on Azazel, but this means I won't get an item unlocked by beating it. Skinny odd mushroom. Tears up, speed up. I don't want it. Damage down is the main reason I don't want that. Basically, it prioritizes rate of fire over actual damage. Champion's Belt versus Black Candle. Champion's Belt is a damage up, but I would love to get rid of curses, so we're going to see if we can get 15 cents and go for the candle. And the other part of that is uh, not all damage ups were made equal. So while it is a damage up, I don't think it's a big one. Okay, that melted. And now we got our 15 cents. Get our candle. Then that would have made the uh, floor of question mark items much easier. We'll see if we can hit uh, 7 cents. We'll go back for the damage belt. 14 minutes. Almost on 15. Oh, drop up. No, no! It got stuck, like, on top of me, and it wouldn't go away. <laughs> oh, damn it. Oh, well, we only took half a heart of damage. No biggie. Alright, we got an arcade. Anything interesting going in here? Do we have a demon judgment blood bank situation? Alright, so this will get us enough money for our other item. So it's only seven cents, which means I want to play this guy a bit and give some keys away too. HP up, that's nice. Monster puddle of pills. Kind of useless. Oh, I might use it once. Take Maggie's Faith just because why not? Ah, oh, that was health up. Nice. Two health ups on uh, an arcade, and they have not come from the, the blood bank machines. If I had enough speed, I'd be able to bounce between those. Alright. Give enough keys. It may just pay out. Well, there is Guppy's tail. That's what I was wanting. So I'll give him one more key since I've got Guppy's tail. I don't want to do much more. Alright, oh, half a heart. Alright, we're done there. Let's check out this. Spirit heart that I'm going to lose half of to leave anyway. Um, Shop. How are we for time? 16, 17 minutes. So he's got three minutes to finish this off. We're almost done anyway. Should be alright. Grab that. Grab that one. Grab that one. Ah, uh, let's pay this. Very wary of this time. We should melt the mum fight pretty quickly. Alright. It's been a while since I managed to put a decent amount of cash into that uh, donation machine too. So I'm happy with that. Sorry, I was just stopping for a drink. Why couldn't that have died the other way around? Alright, help through some more. Alright, here we go. 
Now that's what I call melting. Done. Alright, so we'll take the Polaroid, because we haven't done the chest. Deal with the devil is the, uh, whatchamacallit, Guppy's tail. I had a black heart in there. I'm not sure if this room disappears if I don't go into it. So, a book of secrets, blood rites, and the shears, and a bean. These are horrible. You do get an item for, um, for, for beating it though, so let's just hope it's good. Oh, he already died. Those shears are actually fairly high damage. I might keep that over uh, Guppy's head. Oh, oh my god. I didn't even have to attack it. This is incredible. Yeah, this is the boss rush fight anyway. Basically, you fight every boss on every floor up until this stage. And just one after the other. It sounds harder than it is because, um, well, one, you know, you can see how easily I'm doing this. But, you know, to get here, you're already going to be pretty strong to have been able to done in 20 minutes. And then the other part is look at all the hearts that are everywhere. It's awesome if you have, uh, Dark bomb on this. Get off. Alright. Heart's dead. Let's kill the mask. Good. There's a spirit heart. Two more. That's good. Kill death first because he's a pain. He did just like poop spirit hearts though. Where'd the horse go? Hey, die. Alright. Fallen. Melted both. Alright, so now we get a choice between uh, the, the personal shield thing or ten bombs. Um, yeah, the holy mantle is a very good item. And I'm going to keep the shears, not Guppy's head. Alright, because the shears do a massive amount of damage now. But yeah, Holy Mantle means we can uh, take damage once in a room without actually taking damage. Which makes it so you can kind of... No, you can't play Blood Banks. But you can... go into Curse Rooms for free. But yeah, this, this item basically means that if... Uh, we had a chance of winning before, well, now is no longer a chance. We've won. I don't picture myself losing when I've got Holy Mantle this much health to begin with. Only thing that will make it a bit better is having Dark Bomb. Alright. Health up. If I go to um, Demon Judgment there, he'll take my Eternal Heart that I got from Maggie's Faith. You're a prick pin. Oh, I need an itch. <laughs> well, at least now we don't have to worry about time. Well, that'll complete my eternal heart. We can go in here. We shall blow up some fires. And now I can leave without taking any damage. Love that. We got double spirit heart here, so we'll go play this dude twice. Oh, here he takes. Oh, that's why we got a wafer. Oh my god, <laughs> we we have no chance of losing at all with the wafer as well. I forgot we even had it. We take 
half a heart of damage instead of a whole heart. Like, there's nothing that can stop us. Absolutely nothing. So even once they kill my shield, they can then only deal half a heart of damage per hit. He killed my shield. He didn't even get a look in. And there's hearts everywhere. GG. Well, at least we get to see the uh, the blue baby fight. I haven't actually killed him yet on any character. I've been close because I've been doing uh, seated runs that don't actually unlock any progress. When I've been close, I've been down to the chest. I just never actually got to the boss fight. And that said, I did better than uh, Northern Lion in that run too. <laughs> oh, it's funny. That was just because I made a slightly better choice on something. I think I didn't pick up Monstro's Lung because I've sworn off of that thing forever. And he did and ended up being out way better for me. So, you know. Well, Maggie's Faith isn't going to do much good for us now, so we might as well take Umbilical Cord, even though it's next to useless for us. Ignoring that. Open this. Cricket's head, damage up. I'm happy with that. Right, that bomb just, uh, wow. Took away our shield, no big deal. Let's blow a few of these up. Nothing. Alright, we go in here, we use the shears, and then we own Conquest. Shears didn't even get to do anything. We got his horse or our health up. We're taking the health up. Alright, let's go. And then, do it here, or do we not? Let's have a look in the arcade. Well, if I can get down to one heart, which is a bit of a big ask when I'm only taking half a heart of damage. Um, well, that red heart drops good. What caused that? Oh, I have a bag. I am. I can do this. Alright. Let's put that back, and then we go check out our boss trap room. <laughs> we can skip the floor. I kind of want to fight Mum's heart. He hurt my shield. No, we've only got Chub now. Done, does the deal with. Can get these red hearts. And the money just in case. Tarot card is the hero font. We just drop that there. We'll keep the Emperor. I want to use that um, either on the cathedral or on the chest. I think I'll use it on the cathedral. Because on the chest, the rooms have um, a chance of. Dropping a chest, which is actually just an instant item. So, even though the rooms are harder, there's, you know, bigger chance you're going to get a good payout. Oh my god, there's a magnetic... Magnetic gut. Faith up. I knew that one was going to blow. Faith up is useless. I'm just going to step out of here and step back so we can use Holy Mantle on this. We blow this up. Good shot, Spectral Buddy. And then we leave. Alright. Wrong target. Alright. Oh good. He got my shield, but I uh, set, decided to play it careful after that. So that was all they got. Same as this, like that. The holy shield is hugely overpowered just because it saves you from getting whittled down. 
And the wafer is almost the same. I don't even know what monkey's board does. So we're going to keep it. Sure, I'll use a bomb to find out if there's anything. Nothing. Alright. It lives. But not for very long. Kind of implied. Easy. Very, very easy. So we know the deal with the devil is nothing. Let's go to the cathedral. And like I said, on the cathedral. Oh, we'll have a look in here first. Leech. Ah, sure, let's do it. Yeah, I did lose my shield. Alright. <laughs> Find a secret room. Give him two keys, that's all I'm giving him. Shouldn't have gone through there. Lemon party, eh? Well, they're going to go fight the boss. I could have got room charges, um for the shears, but I figured I didn't want to. This fight has gone very quickly. I just need to do a hit and run. Dodge in, dodge out. And then maybe we can get a kill. There we go! Alright, this is going very quickly. We're down to the chest. Hmm. There's a golden door here too. Forgot about that. We're only half an hour in. And oh my god. Okay, so we got Cricket's body. That is splash damage. Doesn't work on this. This is Virgo? Ares, ramming to oh, Okay, it's the... That looks ridiculous. <laughs> then we got Anika's cookbook and uh, Doctor's remote. Both are pretty much worthless. And I'm going to stick with the shears. Alright, bloke. First thing. He's dead. We got a chest. Little brimstone. Alright, see, that's why I didn't want to skip straight to the boss. Alright, hourglass. I shall keep the shears. Alright, what's through here? Keys. Want. The other advantage um, is since we have the holy mantle, I'm not going to get whittled down room by room um, as fast as I normally would, due to the the fact that what should we call it? I can survive a hit. There's no point entering there. This is like an eight monster room. Are you effing me? Cheers. Go for it, buddy. I didn't know this existed. Eight monstros. We just took, lost our shield. And we just killed all the monstros. <laughs> oh, am I glad we got that shield. The quarter. Yeah, that's, that's useful. Oh, well, now I just need money equals power. I found him. Alright. Try this way. Double gate. Could do without the leapers. Thanks. Oh, I hate this boss. And I hate it more when there's two of them. Yeah, you knew that was going to happen. There was one room I was going to take damage on. It was this. Alright. I just need a spirit heart. Oh, there's some creep. 
Well, if there's another boss I hate, it's this one. <laughs> I just lost my shield because I ran into him when he was doing the whole thing. And I just took damage because he farted on me. Holy water. Useless. Alright, we kill Wrath last. Maybe get a cool bomb item. Nope, just bombs. We're not getting any spirit hearts at all. Which is kind of worrying me when it comes to longevity and replacing the spirit hearts that I am losing. Also very nice. Oh, here we go. You found it. I was going to say it would be very nice to have a map and compass on this floor. It's huge. Yeah, it's just a chest. It's not a chest XL. That's shooting out the back of your head. There it is. Yeah, <laughs> cool. Alright, here we go. Blue baby fight. No idea what happens. Well, he seems to be just like the Isaac fight, except a little tougher. And we minced him. So, there we go. Blue baby beat. The end. Or is it? Dun 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 dun. Alright. Do we get an item? Abaddon. No idea what that is. Golden God. Oh, we got Golden God. Sweet. Look at me, Golden God. <laughs> Let's go. Cool. Alright, guys. Guess that'll do it for this. That was fun. We had a win. That's why I chose Azazel. Anyway, thanks for watching, and I hope to see you next time.